Okay, okay. So let's start. Mm -hmm. G6, G3. Some theoretical line that I haven't looked at in a long time, of course, but uh, let's see if I can remember how it goes. So this, I think, or is it bishop g5 first? I think it's like this. Bishop g7, I take on c6, and I try to play with the good knight against the bad bishop. That is the bishop on c8, it's often gets into trouble here, long term. Okay, so this, I guess I'm moving here. I'm not afraid of knight before because the knight belongs to f5. I think he should go knight e7 at some moment here. Let's see, he takes. Now I can take with b and get bishop on, or with the queen. Let's try with the b, just to go bishop a3 uh, immediately. I would also li like to play h4 maybe in some moment, but I'm not sure if it's maybe a little bit too early. So let's say bishop a3. Very important to stop c5 because it would release his bishop. Now I want bishop c5, knight e5, maybe in some moment, maybe still this h fall that I was talking about. So maybe first knight e5, if it doesn't blunder anything. Hmm. Let's see now, rook d5 is a move, but not sure it helps him so much. Queen c7 seems more normal. Aha, now he wants c5. I better stop it. Rook d5 will threaten to sacrifice on c5. I need to address it. Maybe knight g4. Don't really like this knight g4, but now the knight is there and what to do? So knight e3. Now my knight is really misplaced. <laughs> I'm not sure why I played like this. He wants e5? Maybe he wants e5. I would play rook e. This was really not very precise play by me. I think I'm slowly approaching slightly worse from a very comfortable position. So I guess if he takes, maybe I should just take with the bishop. Or can I take with the pawn? Bishop takes, queen f4, why not? Yeah. I mean, his bishop on a6 is still slightly, slightly problematic for him, but it really is like uh, a minor issue. Now, let's see. He wants c5. I need to have something against it. Now I want knight d5 if he plays c5. I think it works. This is another way. Queen f3, I guess. What else? Yes. Rook e6, he needs to play probably to cover queen f6. Uh, what should I do then? Maybe it's time to play c4. Why not? Yeah, just to play bishop c3 and not get... Uh... Ah, so now he wants c5, but c5 he still cannot play. I will play some rook b1. But I don't really have a clear plan. That's that's a problem. Uh, let's try to protect. Does he want actually to... Maybe I should play c5 myself. Yeah. I'm not playing very well this part. Can I double on uh, on the d file? Maybe I can. Now we can take and play bishop g7, but I'm not so scared. Why am I not so scared? Uh -huh. He gives up on c6. Now maybe knight d5 is a threat. I, I really don't understand what what this move was. Maybe he missed the c6 was hanging. Uh, so now knight d5 is a huge threat. Uh, and his bishop is hanging. So I, to be honest, I, it's beginning to look quite quite good for me. Let's see this. Let me take. He has to take with a pawn. Can I play c6? Rook c8. Is it possible or bishop e5 is a move, but then he comes rook c6. I should make a move. I'm playing too slowly now. Now rook e4, this was not very good. Bishop d6, he can take on e3 twice. 
was absolutely not great. Let's see. Okay, I need to speed up basically. Rook f6 is my idea, but maybe it doesn't work. Okay, bishop f4. I think it was a blunder, but okay, now it's all about time. Uh, this, this. Let's see. Ah, very nice, very nice. Of course, I missed this stalemate trick. But I was also a bit worried because I was getting so, I mean, it was mainly about time at that moment, but still, I should see this simple stalemate, of course, of course, yeah. What to do? Okay, draw. Let's see now. What is this? Mm -hmm. Catalan. Okay, let me take and play this old line. Just trying to keep the pawn on b5. So b5, b7, a4, what is this? a4, I guess a6, or not b7, no a6, I think. Yeah. What is this? Bishop e7. Now we can take and win back the pawn, but I don't think that white is particularly better there. So castles, okay, 95 is another move, but I think this is fine as well. Uh, let's see, bishop f6 is a move, but then knight g4 comes. Uh, e4 is possible, but it's a bit double-edged because he gives me some squares as well. If plays d5, I have some squares, I thought. Let me see, I take, I play bishop f6, I think. Now knight c6 is his ID for sure. Now what do I do? If I take and play rook c8, he plays rook d6. Can I win something there? I can also play, let's see, take, take, rook c8, rook d6, bishop e5, rook d7. Do I dare to do it? I have no idea. Okay, let me try. Hmm. Rook d6 now. I'm a bit worried actually. Maybe I did not defend this very well. Bishop h3, no, but then I can take on c6. So let's see what is going on here. Rook d6, bishop e7, then rook d7. Yeah, that's not very good. Rook d7 immediately. What if I now take on c6? He takes and plays rook. Let's see this. Uh huh. Yeah, but can I avoid it? I probably can't, yeah. G6, he plays this, and no, I need to take. Ah, rook d7 immediately. Knight d4. What is knight d4? I play knight d4. Let's see what happens. Probably it's time for me to play some sort of. Can I play knight b3? Takes, takes on. Let me try knight. I mean, playing for the advantage, but I don't think I have any, any reason to, to try to be better here, but why not? Why not try it? Bishop h3, I just go rook d8, I think. Bishop d5, okay, let me take. King h8. So now it's actually hanging on c4, yeah? That's, that's a problem. Uh, that's actually a major problem. Knight d4. Then he takes my bishop. Ah, oh, shit. This was actually very problematic. And my, I'm very low on time. This was, I could have just made the draw. Yeah, okay, now I have to defend this for, uh, for a long time. Really unpleasant position. Yeah, what to do? I'm Luft at least. But yeah, it was not very nice at all. Let's see. Maybe I should try to trade the bishops at least. Mm -hmm. Bishop f5, rook f8. 
Now if it takes, I can take with the knight maybe. Then g4 is a move, but it's very drawish now. Uh, let's see. Mm -hmm. He wants to get a passed pawn on the on the e file. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's see, what can I do? Knight e1, then king g1, then knight. Doesn't seem very trustworthy. Can I play yes, rook e8? Why not yes, rook e8? Ah, bishop g6, and I cannot take. Yeah, this was not great. Let's see, knight d2. Ay, 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 this was problematic. Mm -hmm. Rook f7. Will I have a fortress or not? I hope I will. Let's see now. Is my knight stuck? I hope not. Maybe it is. Hmm. This was unlucky. Or yes, very bad. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, the problem was that I played with, for the win. Yeah, one move too much. So now, okay. I need to, I guess I need to put more pressure. But I was very happy with my opening the last time. I think I will just try to do the same. Uh -huh, D5. What is this now? Let's see, how do they play? Mm -hmm. So knight c3, I think I will take with the b pawn. Let's, let's see, bishop c4. Now it's no longer that great. So we have some sort of cemetery style position. Mm -hmm. How do we play such? I guess h4 should come relatively soon. Bishop d3, mm -hmm. h4 next, I guess. That's how people play nowadays with the h-pawn. So basically, uh, I'm delaying a little bit the development of my bishop on c1 because it doesn't really have any good square. I'm hoping to get some uh, h5, h6 going. Uh, Let's see, I guess at some point he should take. Let's he doesn't take yet. H5. Now it's if h6, I'm hoping to have some sort of let's say knight e5 followed by queen g4 or something like that. So he lets me go all the way. That's what people do nowadays. So I guess I have to follow. So here is the question. Sometimes I've seen people go g3, but bishop g5 is also interesting. Is it hanging on d4 after bishop g5? I guess it is. g3 looks more normal, more sensible. I will play as yes, bishop f4, develop. Then later I will make use of this weakness on, on g7, I hope. Uh, let's see. Mm. Bishop f4, then knight e5, knight g4, some idea like this, followed by. So queen c6, e4 is hanging, is it? Is it not? I hope not. Bishop g5, he goes f6. Okay, let me play bishop f4. f5 is his idea. Ah, but then, then d5, right? Then d5. Yeah, it shouldn't work. Maybe his idea is... No, but queen a4 is very strange. So this, I was hoping that I could play... Can I play even knight e5? Knight e5, queen a4. Should be... Yeah. Ah. Okay, bishop g5 first. Let's see. Now I want knight e5. Now I really want knight e5. Knight e5. Now knight g4 next. If it doesn't take, if it takes, it's very, very bad from the dark squares, I hope. Let's see. Queen c7. Knight g4, f5 is an idea. Maybe I should. Hmm. Or maybe not. I'm thinking, should I play bishop f6 first? Okay, doesn't matter he, because he does this. I guess I need to play bishop f6. I may be tempted to sacrifice the pawn. Can I say, how do I sacrifice this, 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 this? Bishop mm -hmm, mm -hmm. f6, knight c6, yeah? Not sure. 
Bishop f6, knight c6. I have something there or not? Rook ac1. Yeah, I will try. We will see. Knight d4. I, 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 I missed this. But does it matter? Queen b2. Queen e3. Queen e3. Queen b4. Ay, 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 queen b2. Let me see. Queen b2. Knight f3, king g2, queen d4. Yeah? You must play probably. Can I play something else here? Or should I just take it? Takes, takes, bishop, queen e2. I can also play queen e2. Knight takes e5. Do I have a trick? Should be one. Rook c1. Okay, let me try. I have no idea what is going on. Ah, he takes on c1 first. Oops. Uh, still, he cannot get out, but I don't trust it. Can I play f4 next? Maybe I can play f4 next. Queen d6. Uh, queen, where should I go? Queen b2. Let's try queen b2. Knight g4, bishop e7. Knight d3. Mm -hmm. Take, take, f3. Can I do it? Do I have, I have to, ah, oh, shit, my time again. Ay, ay, ay. So he would probably sacrifice an e4. What else? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now flagging time starts. Okay, so I think actually it was a relatively relatively decent game. I mean, of course, I lost control there somewhere after losing the central pawns, but overall I'm happy with the game. Built some pretty decent pressure. So let's see what is going on now. Maybe some Sicilian we can get, yeah? Let's see, a6. Uh, how does it go? Knight c6 I play. He will play d4 in some moment, I guess. Or maybe not. Uh -huh. This is to me something, something a bit new. How do I react? e5 maybe? Giving some squares, but on the other hand, not so clear what he's doing with the squares I'm giving. Knight d4 take. I have to take and see. I don't want that. I guess I should play rook b8. h6 is a move I should play as well. I should have played h6. Mm, let's see. Take, take. Bishop g5, bishop e6. I hope I'm not blundering anything. Knight d7, maybe I should. No, h6. I think I will play h6. A4, okay, H6, one my ID. Knight there, okay, knight d4, I guess I have to play. Or knight d4 is also interesting to stop. Uh, knight d4, knight d5, take, take, not so nice. Knight b4, better. Now b5 I want. Do I want? Yeah, I want. Should I want it? I will not even attempt to answer, but I want it. B5, knight e3, c4, takes, takes, knight d5, take, ten. okay, why not? Let's see. Ah, c4, I cannot play. Ooh, I cannot play c4. Wow. Okay, so I have to play this in a sort of less inspiring way. Queen d6. Is it a move? Let's see. He can play f4, but I'm not so scared of f4. I think in general, if he starts to attack, I'm happy. But I don't want to take on d5 next. So I really have no idea what my next move is. g6, h5, no, no, no. 
So he takes. Mm -hmm. Knight a2. No, he cannot play the knight a2. The takes was very strange. Now with knight d5, I take it. I guess I have to take it. Rook fc8. I'm attacking the pawn on c2, stopping queen g4. Hmm. Uh, maybe I'm misevaluating, but I don't think that I'm worse actually. I would like to get my bishop active, but it's too much to ask for. Just bishop e7, I guess. Or rook c3 first. Queen b1, bishop e7. Maybe even tripling on the on the c file is not such a bad idea. Ah, queen g4 is maybe his idea. Apparently d4 is his idea. Okay, take, take. Bishop f6, not so good. Okay, bishop f6 immediately. Mm-hmm. I mean, I'm, I'm completely safe for sure, but do I have any realistic chances to be better? Yeah, it's not enough. I don't think I have enough to play for to be better. It's my just my guess. In rook b3, he should definitely play now to trade. He doesn't. Okay, rook c4, b3. I thought this rook is maybe not so strong on, on b3. Queen a2. Why not just come back? Yeah. Queen b1, I think, is the only move to not get trapped. Mm -hmm. He had another move. What should I do? Rook e8? Now oh, it's getting tense, actually. So this. Can I play rook e2? I feel I'm starting to get myself a bit overloaded here on the... Should probably move the rook from uh... now. Maybe double on the second if I'm allowed. Am I allowed? Queen c5 is another interesting move. Ah, but now he stopped it. I should probably. I should just speed up actually, to be honest. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's see now. I think I'm doing very well now. Hmm. Yeah, this looks great. Hmm. I think actually my connection was pretty bad in the end because uh, I lost a few precious seconds. Might be the same for him actually. Overall, uh, not a very exciting game. So we're frankly speaking, playing pretty boringly now. But and qual quality, I have no idea. Maybe no big blunders, which is sort of the most you can hope for. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Some very solid style. What is this queen e2? D4, I'm hoping that I have some trick. But I never, I can I'm never really remember when it works and when it doesn't. Queen d7, rook fd1. D4 takes, I guess. Takes. Takes. What is this? Knight takes e6 is not a move. Rook, it does it look a bit scary? Knight takes e6. Rook e8. 
to be honest, I mean, uh, am I going completely nuts or? So I think it works. Maybe I'm getting mated actually. Ah, this might be the point. But it's hard to believe that I'm mated here. It's getting harder every move also. D3, queen h3, f3. In this I thought I can play knight e4. Let's see, I'm very confused. Materially speaking, I'm doing pretty okay. Rook e1 maybe, then he goes f5. F5, h3, and it's too dangerous. F3 immediately. And this, maybe just take it, yeah. Ah, this was not uh, not the best technique, I guess. But okay, I'm threatening d4, so it should be okay. F5, d4. Hmm. K8, so this is not, maybe I should not play d4 so quickly. Now maybe d4 take, rook takes. Yeah, still dangerous. What about d4? d4? I really want to play d4. Which is strange because I see that it loses an exchange, but I'm hoping to sort of release the pressure a bit. But why would I now be better is, is the question, yeah. Ah, it's very un unnecessary, I think. Let's see. I should still be okay, but why I entered all of this is to me very unclear. Queen e8. Uh, rook a d1. Now bishop c5, maybe rook d8 is a move. Mm -hmm. Next, maybe I want to move my king, but king f1 is also very ugly. Not sure, maybe I can just play something like h6. I, I actually have no idea what is going on here. It's way above my pay grade. <laughs> As they say, rook d7, bishop c5, rook d8. I still go for it. Rook e1, king g2, I think doesn't help him. Now I'm just a pawn up again, I think. Okay, so let's see. Let's see if I just push. Uh, okay. Time to take maybe. Yeah, this looks really good actually. Yeah, I mean, I don't know what was going on there, this sacrifice and so on. Maybe it's known, maybe I underestimated something, maybe he mixed up. I have no idea. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's see what he's up to now. Mm hmm. London system. Okay. 
London system always welcome. For. It cannot be for white. I refuse to believe it. On the other hand, my score is not particularly good against the London, so I'm not sure why I'm so happy to face it. He wants to cast a long, but then d4, surely. Yeah? I should be way ahead after his c3 move as a weakness. Like no, shot castle, he will play. I think shot castle. Now, if I play d4, my bishop is running the risk of getting out of play. Can I do something more exciting? b6 is a move I consider maybe rook e8 first. He will play rook to d1 for sure. Then queen b6. Uh, queen b6, mm -hmm. ed5, I think some e4 might be pretty promising for me. That, that, okay, that will require some calculation, which I'm not sure I'm capable of, but at least should be an interesting try. This, let's see, rook ad1, rook ad8, queen a5 is a move as well. Just wanted to stabilize a bit before. Uh-huh. Queen c5 is a move, queen a5 is a move, queen a5 b4 maybe. Queen c5 takes, takes. Let me try queen c5. Bishop takes g6, h takes, knight e4, I think I can take on c3. In general, my idea is that I'm able to take on c3 next. Otherwise, this whole business doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Hmm. Is it possible? Looks like it's possible. And also there's, even if he moves the pawn, there's a fork, so. If I'm lucky here, I'm actually doing pretty well. Let's see. Uh, I can play knight d4, but I don't think I want to just chat. So e4 immediately or first trade? Maybe e4 immediately. Why did I play e4? Rather regretting. Queen d5, knight takes e4, f5. Does it work? Knight c3 does work, yeah? But do I want to, even if it works? No, I don't want to. I want to play just f5. If I want to play f5, then queen b2. I'm not impressed with my technique because now he has a huge knight. Then again, who am I to evaluate? Let's see, rook e5 maybe. Trying very hard not to blunder anything. King f8 I want next. I need to bring my king, I think. King g3 is what he wants to do. Should I be worried about king g3? Probably not. Uh, now it says that he has some connectivity problems. That's a bit unfortunate. Okay, now he's back. Let's see, rook d3, b4. I think I can just take if I'm not missing anything. Uh, can I play rook b5? No, I should probably just play a6, right? Rook c5, I play just king e7. So this, I thought I could play rook d3. Mm, king e7, I'm bringing my stuff. Or my stuffs, as our friend would say. See, rook uh, b, rook d4, maybe. Rook c5 is a move. So he has some trick now, no? And maybe no trick. Uh, rook b5. Knight f4, king f6, I guess, just to protect. Uh, so g5 I can play next. Maybe I should just play g5. I need to get rid of this weakness actually. g5, he will take on c6. Am I scared of that? I'm scared of that. I'm, I'm in general quite scared. So. When I'm playing these short games. Let's see. Hmm. Seems I lost my connection. Huh? 
No, he's not moving. It says I disconnect. What happened? I'm not sure. It says I'm I'm also disconnected. But should I refresh or what? What happened? Okay, I will stop the stream in one minute. Please stay okay. here.
Okay, thank you. So we are back after some technical difficulties. Hoping the rest of the match will continue normally. I'm hoping my opponent will be able to play. And myself too. Okay, let's go. Mm -hmm. What is this I have not seen in a long time? I think this is pretty normal. Uh, okay, let's see. If I cast he will play some G4 or H4 or what? Maybe that's his idea. Better to be safe. Ah, did I step into some knight takes? Oof, and bishop b5. Bishop b5, c6. Yeah, no, it should never work. I mean, I'm a bit undefended everywhere, but I think it's okay. So this, maybe just h6 now. Okay, it allows his knight to be to be kept, but let's see. I have no idea what this is. It looks looks like a very strange position to my eyes. Should I play c6 or c5? Probably c6. And then in some moment I should play. Ah, he plays like this. So he allows g5, but probably g5 is not, not really the way. c4, c6 I will play. Or will I take it maybe? Maybe take. He has to take with the bishop. Now I thought knight h5 was was a move. Bishop g3, I take with h knight. And then some c5 or c6, and whatever should be okay. Uh, what else? He lets me take. Okay, I think I will take. He wants bishop d3, but I'm not scared. Wants g4 maybe? No, it doesn't want g4. If he wants g4, I will let him play g4. Now I will reroute my knight to d5. Why not? Knight d5. Uh, I guess I need to play queen b6 at some point. Now, ah, oh, knight d7. <laughs> ah, oh, he missed. Very lucky. Oof. Let's see now. F6. Queen C7. I'm very scared. How could I miss that? Okay, he allows F6, but F6, knight C4. Huh? Takes, okay, F6. Let me play F6. Knight C4, I just go back to C7. Was my ID. I'm not sure. I have this, I can get these weak pawns. But I'm not sure how weak they are, actually. They might be quite decent. Uh, no, actually, I probably I'm just worse, actually. I did not play this game very well, but OK. I guess that's the kind of thing that happens. Knight h4. So I guess I need to take. Rook takes. I cannot take an f4. Can I take an f4, actually? Knight takes, takes, rook, queen takes. Lots of stuff is hanging in his position, right? Rook g I will try. I have no idea if it works, but it looks fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah, next I just want to take on h4. And hope that I will not be mated. Takes. Queen f4 is only move. Rook d5 is what I want to do next if I'm allowed. Rook d5. Rook g, queen g. What is this? Uh, rook d5. Rook g4. Something is hanging, yeah? Something is hanging in my position. I will just move my king. I will run away. I'm not sure what I'm doing now. Queen c7 next, rook d5, quickly. 
quickly, quickly. Queen f7, rook d5, rook safe. Maybe rook g5, rook f5, something like this. Rook g5, I think. Yes. Now without rooks, he doesn't have enough rook, I think. F5 even. Let's see what is this. I blundered a pawn. Doesn't matter. Mm hmm. Let me take. Oof. Okay, trade queens. Why not? This should be winning. King okay, seven. Yes. Yes. Okay, so not a very good game, but of course, it's always difficult to break uh, play after such a break. Let's continue. This knight f3 business, it worked, worked decently so far. g3. What is this? Uh, c4. No, short castle. And Grinfeld reversed. Let's see, bishop b2. Probably knight bd2. Problem with the reversed Grinfeld is that it's like comfortably equalizing, but never ever close to be better at all. Let's see, takes. Bishop takes, he will play. I go knight f3. Can I go e4? Maybe e4 is a move. No, knight f3, I guess. Queen d2, then queen b2. Queen b2. Fd1. Slightly better or not slightly better? That is the question. Knight e5. f3, e4, maybe. Play for initiative. Do I have any grounds to hope that I have initiative? I don't know, and I don't care. Let's see now. Mm -hmm. Maybe this is actually not so bad for me. With knight d6, I have e4. When he moves to the bishop, I can take it and play e5. I think maybe actually this is pretty good for me. Knight c5, of course, is a move. What would I do then? I take, I take on c6, I play e5, and his bishop is offside. Is it enough? Well, it's, it's as much as I'm getting, so I guess I guess I will have to take it. So this is okay. It's a complete surprise to me. Bishop d4, bishop takes e5, bishop takes c5, bishop takes b2, bishop takes f8. He calculated all this. Wow. That was very impressive. Wow. What should I do? King f1, maybe. Takes, takes, takes. Knight seven, rook d8. Mm -hmm. Well played to him. Very nice resource he found. I guess f4 is fine. Yeah, it should just be a draw now. But of course, it's always possible to, uh, to blunder. Uh, king f3, I guess. Why did I play king f3? I have no idea what this is. King f3. Hmm. 
Mm -hmm. Am I getting outplayed? Maybe I'm getting outplayed. Counterplay, should I get counterplay? No, I should not get counterplay. Counterplay I will get later, maybe in the next game. Hmm. E5 is a move, but then I give check on D6. King E4, King E2, King E4. Let's play, let's play King E4. Mm -hmm. A4, I guess. Take with the rook. Very drawish. Mm -hmm. B4. Rook A2. Rook B6, I thought I could play maybe King F3. Yeah, that's the safest. Rook B3, Rook A5. C5, I guess, is very safe. Mm -hmm. So he tries to flag me. Ah, shit. ah it must slip. Shit. I wanted to go longer. Yeah, that was a very strange game. Very, very strange game. I do not think that I deserve to win it, but in this format, I guess you need to take all the points you can get. So, okay. I'll take it and see what happens. Mm -hmm. Let's see now. Takes, take 97. Knight f6. G6, mm, I guess. I thought such such should be a bit comfortable for white, but maybe I'm not getting something. Bishop e2. Can I play e5 or is it too ambitious? e5. Knight b3, I wanted, uh, but it doesn't play knight b3, so it doesn't matter what I wanted. Bishop e6, maybe. Bishop e3. Queen e7, queen d6 is not so nice. Knight fd7, maybe. I really misplaced my pieces here, is, uh, I have a feeling. Can I play knight a4? Doesn't make any sense. This is a threat. A6, bishop c5, knight c5, queen c5, a b. Looks fun. Looks fun. Doesn't look very good, but basically I'm hoping that my bishop pair will be strong someday. Let's see what is going on. This, 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 this. C3. Knight e c5, I guess. Should I take and play knight a4? Knight a4 immediately, I may probably take first. I like this knight on a4, but it's not enough for me to be equal, unfortunately. So takes, takes. Kick him away. Mm -hmm. This was a bit unfortunate. I don't want to play f6. Can I do something else? Should be seven. I can play faster, probably. I can attempt to play faster. Knight b6, rook d6, hc. Ah, oh, shit, my position is really quite bad now. 
94 is a move. Does it help? Even if it doesn't help, it should probably be played, right? Just for the fun of it. Yeah, but it really doesn't help at all. D5, 96, you will play. Shit. Uh, B5, 96. Knight C4, I guess, but it's not fun at all. Knight A8 is very, very, very sad. Okay, why not? <laughs> this was terrible. Okay, I need to, to play better than this. This was actually quite bad. Rook D7, B5, Rook takes F7, it's one win. Uh, okay, maybe F5 anyway. No, this was terrible. Terrible, terrible. Ooh. That, we always fight till the end. Knight C7, CB, Knight B5. Not sure it works. Not sure at all that it works. Rook d7, then at least I go to e6. Do I? I mean, I'm losing a pawn if I do it. Do I have anything else? Probably not. Shit. This is really very bad for me. Eh? He will take, I play e4. I'm pretending, but not for, not for a lot. Now I knight c5, I guess. Rook d5. It's a very sad story, all of this. Knight c5, knight e6. Takes bishop f8. Yeah. Not my dream when I started the game. Uh, he will play bishop e, bishop b3, yeah? Okay, king h8. Let's see what he has. Maybe he has rook takes e5. Yeah, okay. It's game over, and it has been for a while. Yeah. Let's see, knight e6. Maybe not the simplest way by him, but okay, it's good enough. Mm -hmm, I before I take it at least. Yeah, this is dead lost. Actually, final position I'm winning, but okay. <laughs> Doesn't matter at all. Okay, this was a bad game. Let's play better next. Let's see what he does. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What is going on? Yeah. Oop, no slip. I seem to recall from some old Petrosian games that castling is a bit dubious with the vision on g5, but maybe that's just not valid anymore. I thought this kind of stuff was supposed to be a bit better for white, but 
maybe it's just completely equal. Probably it is. Yeah, yeah, I have to admit it doesn't look impressive. Can I play it for C4 maybe? That could be some sort of idea. It opens up a bit, but it also gives me some targets on, uh, on E6. Could be an ID. No ED, then F4, yeah? I missed. So I have to take here. Not my ID. But C5 next. If it doesn't stop it. Let's see. Actually, maybe he should take on C4 and play bishop d5 just to block. I have no idea. Could be actually the move because C5, I think, is a positional threat if I understood this correctly. Yeah. Rook C8, Rook C1. He can still take on C4. Play bishop d5. Can I play b3 in such a position and take with the C4? It looks a bit strange. Maybe I need to do something like that because if I just make normal moves, I might end up slightly worse even. Queen b3, take, take, queen d5. Doesn't. Let me try b3. No, it's too strange. b3, take, take. Okay, b3. What? Why not? Very strange move. But okay. h3, h6, take, take. Queen e, queen e2, maybe. Queen e2. Now I will take with the rook on c4. And then with the queen. Can I play rook c7? Queen takes d4, queen takes e6. Some checks. Doesn't matter. Uh -huh. Let's see. What is this? Looks like not enough for me to hope for anything. Maybe g3 should be played in some moment just to not give him too many checks. g3. No, rook c4, I would say. Seven franc looked, looked nice, but I, I don't know what I'm doing there. So this queen e3, is b5, then I play rook c5, okay. I mean, not better for me, but also not worse, probably. Goes for it. I guess now it's just a draw. And I'm, I'm very happy that he didn't play on. Of course, it's possible to play for, for time, and he's probably faster than me, but at least we have some sort of um, common sense still. Okay, that was a very wasted white, of course. Let's see now. Let's go back to Sicilian. What is this? I like my position last time here, but I'm not sure I had any reason to do it. Maybe I should put my, my bishop on e7 instead of g7. Why not? Okay, now we are getting some some Sicilian. He wants to take on c6 or not? No. Okay, all my life I play this Chevening. It's not a very critical way of making use of his move order, but let's see. I think he's supposed to take with the with the queen. But okay, who cares? Queen d3 now is the move. Now queen d6. Knight, knight d7, I thought. Knight d5, I take it. It takes with the pawn, and then I'm happy because I have a structure. Uh, let's see. If he lets knight e5, I'm also happy. Let's see, knight e5. It cannot take. Yeah, can you take? I'm not sure if he should take. He takes. No, I thought I have some. I will play f4, maybe even. E4, can I play E4? I like E4. In general, in these kind of positions, I like to try to deliver mate. F5, I play. Let's go. Queen H6. E5. 
J3, but now then I play F4. D6, Bishop F4. Mm -hmm. He's not afraid of queen g5, apparently. Yeah. Why not? I should go to h4, maybe. Mm -hmm. Rook b3, now it's hanging, yeah? Lots of stuff is hanging in my position. Uh, what can I... I need to get some play against the king. And I need it quickly. B6 or B5, B5 takes rook e2, B5 is d7. B5 is not really a move I want to play, but. What is this? I played too fast in, earlier in the game. That's the problem. So now I'm dead lost and I don't have any use for my time. Let's see. This was a disaster. I think I'm completely lost because I, my attack is just nothing. Rook d8, maybe, what should I do? Rook d8, I try. He will take an f4 in some moment. D7, ah, d7. Now at least I'm blocking him, I think I should be doing. Now maybe some rook f6 is coming. Rook f6, then some rook g6 maybe. F6, let's try. Let's see what happens because it could be dangerous for him in some moments if I'm lucky. Of course, g4 is a move, but I don't think he particularly wants to play g4 if he doesn't really have to do it. Uh, what do I play after g4? He plays g4. <laughs> of course, he plays g4 when I say, uh, say that he shouldn't. Queen h4, rook takes f5, then I have queen e1. If it takes with the pawn, what should I do? Maybe rook d6, maybe bishop g3. No, bishop g3 is nothing. The rook d6, let's try. Maybe I can play rook d3. No, rook d3, let's try. I have no idea if it works. Bishop g3, queen, bishop, uh -huh. this, this. Ay, 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 this was not my intention, so take with check. Queen f3, can I take it? I have to take him. Let's see. What is this? Come on. Uh-huh, king g8, king f8. Aha, uh -huh, now I blundered. Mm -hmm. Not great. Yes, okay. Not again a very great game, but maybe I had something instead of rook d3. It just felt so tempting to play. Yeah, who knows? Who knows? Now with white, at least. Try to put some pressure. Knight f3. Mm -hmm. He will come up with something new, of course. He always does. Let's see now. Mm -hmm. Knight c3, bishop b7, maybe I can play d4. E c5 takes. What is this? Maybe take. I have no idea. This looks a bit vaguely familiar, but. Is it theory actually? I have no idea. Maybe BA7. B7 of 
I'm hoping that the B3 pawn will just drop off, but <laughs> that, that might be a sort of naive hope. But I don't know, knight ft4 next? Could be that my dreams will come true. What is he doing against knight ft4? Bishop f6 maybe? But bishop, bishop a3 is a move. I think maybe even rook a3 is a move actually. Is rook a3 a move? Let me try rook a3 despite the move looking like a puzzle move. Hmm. What is this? Knight c7? Nah, knight c7 is not good. e4 is some option in some positions. E no, so takes, takes, knight c7, take, take, pleasant pressure, no? Looks like pleasant pressure. Bishop pair. Yeah, it looks nice. If he doesn't, it maybe can take somewhere, but if he can't, then it's for sure pleasant pressure. Let's see. Knight takes c7. Rook takes b7. Bishop d6, maybe, but. Scary. Okay. Knight takes d5, I guess. Ah, e d5, yeah. This was his point. Okay, let me just develop. I don't know, maybe. It's bishop e3. Bishop e3 was too slow, I think. Now we can go knight a6. Please, bishop a6. Yeah, that was an interesting. Choice. So now I'm a pawn up. Can I play knight c6? Is it some sort of tricks? Knight c6, bishop takes e2. Maybe not. Okay, king f1 is always always solid, always possible. Knight e5, knight c6, maybe, or h3, knight c6. Is it really a draw? This? Let's see. Bishop f3. H4, H5 is coming. Rook D7 is coming. Uh, let's see, Bishop D4. Bishop E6 he will play, Rook D7. Now Bishop C3, I should keep the Bishop, otherwise it's wrong. Let's see now. Is it really winning? I should trade the other Bishop, I think. He stops me. Hmm. What should I do now? Hmm. What can I? Ah, oh, come on! What did I do? Did I just blunder my my pawn up? It was sad. Ah! Oh, did I just blunder my pawn up? Okay, it's just draw. Yeah, I'm not playing three against three with extra time. That was a pity because I really had a clear pawn up. Okay, what to do? Mm. Let's see now. Will he go again for some A3 Sicilian or not? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Okay, Sicilian it is. Uh -huh. I haven't seen this in ages. B6 I used to play when I was a kid. That's why. Bishop A6, trade this guy. Knight C6. Knight C3, this should be taken. Now Bishop E7. 
D5. Ah, I need to play D6 maybe earlier. No, he plays. No, what is this? Am I just worse? Problem is D6, he takes and plays Knight G5. I didn't like. Maybe I should play. Sure, what I should, but I always end up much worse in these positions. Yeah, it's really pity. Takes, 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 takes knight c6. I really hope it holds together. This it looks very dodgy. Maybe b5, b4 is an idea. Yeah, it might be okay. Not fun, but maybe okay. I think B5 is the move. Should be the move. Just to go B4. Now can I play Bishop C5? Some counterattack. Bishop C5. Rook D7, I want Knight D8. 96. Hmm. Knight a5. Rook b5, of course. Yeah. Might have to go back. No, I don't have to go back. I can play knight c4. What is knight c4? Rook d5. Oof. I'm a chicken, I go back. I will play h6 when I get the chance because I really don't trust this. Uh, okay, not bishop b6. Bishop b6, I should really play at some moment soon. Oh, yeah, sorry, h6, I should really play. Probably now, yeah. King h2. Is this knight b8 or knight a5? Knight a5. Knight d8 looks safer. Mm, he wants knight f5. Should I let him? Yeah, I don't know what he's doing. I will just push. Ah, knight d7. Okay, bishop c5. I think it's all under control so far. b3 now, I guess. Rook takes. Mm -hmm. Did I blunder the pawn? I did probably blunder the pawn. Maybe not. I have no idea if I blundered the pawn. Now I don't think it's falling anymore. No, I think it's starting to look pretty good. Knight e3. Rook c8. Knight d1, rook c2. Knight f1, rook... Can I play bishop c3? C3. I want rook c4 and then rook b4. That is my idea. Rook c5, I start. No, the rook c5, the knight e4. Rook c7, let's say. Yeah? Why not? What is this? I really want to get. I really want to promote my pawn. Bishop d4, knight f5. Okay, what is this? Knight e4. Now rook c c1. This rook d1. Oh, I think it's winning. Yeah, yeah, now it's definitely winning. Yeah, okay, good news. Let's see what is going on. So now I need a draw, right, David? Okay. But I will, of course, make a draw by trying to win, which is uh, <laughs> which is a classical strategy. <laughs> no.
That's <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's see. He's picking what to do now. Mm hmm C4, C5, wow. Next. This, this queen takes, knight C3, take, take, A6, maybe G3, knight C2, bishop G, no, bishop G2, bishop no, not castle. Mm -hmm. Bishop G5, maybe some move next. I like bishop G5. It's like already some pressure, but maybe I'm very naive. Bishop e6. Can I play? Okay, I should put it. What should I do? Take a knight d5, maybe. Then it goes bishop d8. Let's try rook c1. Now, for sure, if he castles, I will take and play knight d5. Mm. He plays h6. I guess I take. I guess maybe bishop d5 is interesting. Uh, I thought it was hanging on a seven. Maybe I'm missing something. Maybe he is the one missing something. Let's see. Now I'm pretty confident, or not confident, but I'm pretty happy at least with my position. So this now, bishop b7, he takes on c3, bc. Should I avoid? I should probably avoid it. It looked way too complicated for me. Keep it simple. With some chances of success. So what is this? Okay, it's hanging on b7. I guess it's possible to take. Rook b8, knight c5 is my idea. B3, bishop a6, maybe. Let's put it on on uh... so after a4 I want rook c5. I think it makes sense. I should just not get mated on the back rank. That's my main. Goal here. Yeah. No, it's actually looking pretty decent for me. I have to say. I don't mind my position at all. Rook d5, I guess, is the move. Oh, well, I should take the bishop. I forgot. Or I missed. Oof. But okay, should still be okay. It should still be okay, I guess. King g2. Maybe rook takes d4 first. Should that be too bad? This king d2, bishop c6, bishop d3, maybe f3 next. Yeah, it looks looks pretty safe, I have to say. Uh, rook d4, bishop d5, rook a4. Rook a6, I guess. The problem for him, of course, that a draw is not enough as well. Other problem is that he's a few pawns down. G4, okay, take, 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 take here. Okay. Let's see. Hmm. Rook a2, rook h5. Mm -hmm. What is this? He has some ID. Rook e5. King f8, rook e5. Knight f6, knight takes g4. Uh, rook c5, I guess it's okay. Rook c1. Now I should just push my pawns. Yeah, it's the fastest way. Okay. Okay. Congratulations. Yeah, thank you. I, I don't know. Today I was, uh, I was quite tired after this commentary, but... Yes, it was a really strange match, but really. Yeah, it was a strange <laughs> match. I think some of the games were sort of relatively good, but. Yeah. Uh, 
I mean, some, some games were just sort of no one did anything and then someone blundered, yeah. Which, <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, your, next, uh, your next match will be hard. You yeah, know. it's uh, against Magnus now, yeah? Uh, yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, it will be, of course, incredibly fun to play him. Yes. Did you play with Magnus in the past? No, we played some training games, of course. I was in his team for... Ah, okay. <laughs> but I also played, actually, in official games. Yes. It's one draw in Blitz, in no HS. <laughs> okay. Ah, I one game, so I, <laughs> I don't think I'm uh, equal or anything. Yeah. No, no, it will just be a fun experience, of course, to, to yeah. play the match. Of course. Okay, then uh, congratulations for the match and really congratulations yeah. because uh, you streamed today a lot of hours. And yeah, you... thank you very much. <laughs> but okay, chess is fun, so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you did a very good work today and uh, yeah. you can rest now. <laughs> yeah, finally, finally. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you. Thank Maybe you. Bye-bye.